So you're thinking of moving to the city of Henderson here in Las Vegas? In this video, we're gonna show you a couple of houses here in Henderson that you can get for around $500,000. So let's get after it right now. If this is your first time to the channel, you want to know everything there is to know about Henderson, moving to Las Vegas, living in Las Vegas and Henderson, go ahead and hit subscribe, tap that bell for notifications, and you'll be the first in the know for everything that's happening here in Henderson and Las Vegas. Hey, my name's Anthony. I'm a former attorney turned real estate professional who's roots in the Las Vegas area since 1981. So I know a thing or two about this city. And every day I get phone calls, texts, and emails from people just like you looking to make their move to Henderson. And I I absolutely love it. Look, if you're looking to move in the next 90 to 90 days, go ahead and shoot me a text, give me a call, send me an email, and we'll go ahead and make your move as smooth as possible. So today we are in the district, and this is outdoor shopping area here attached to Green Valley Ranch Casino and Resort. It's got things like Anthropology, Williams Sonoma, REI, but more than that, it's got restaurants, it's got Look at this. Look at the kids playing in the splash park. There's just a lot of fun for everyone here and it's a great place to go. But what we're gonna do today is we're gonna look at some homes in the 500,000-ish dollar range. We're gonna show you what that looks like here in Henderson. We're actually gonna look in two areas in Henderson. We're gonna look in the new area of Henderson, which we're gonna look at a home in Inspirata for about $500,000, and a home in the Anthem Hills, Anthem Highlands area for about $500,000. Then we're gonna switch over and we're gonna come closer to this area, and we're gonna go in the Green Valley area, and we're gonna take a look at a couple of different homes that were built a little bit more earlier. They were built in the early 90s. Now that's typical of here. This is the middle Henderson area. So from Eastern over, so you have Anthem, Seven Hills, Inspirata, all of those areas we consider New Henderson. And that's the newest construction that has gone on since about 2010-ish. This is Middle Henderson. Middle Henderson has all of the homes that were built in approximately the early 90s through about 2010. What you'll find in the Middle Henderson area, the homes are a little bit bigger. The homes are on a little bit larger uh, lot sizes. However, you do get 90s construction. But what we see is that most of the homes have been upgraded and updated continuously to bring them up with current standards. So it is still a fantastic place to live and you can get some great values for a little bit more affordable per square foot price in the middle Henderson area. But let's stop talking about it. Let's get in the car. Let's go to our first house, which is going to be in Inspirata and take a look and see what that is. All right, let's go. Okay, so we are here at our first home and this is in Inspirata. Inspirata is one of the newest developments here in the Henderson area and it is probably one of the most coveted areas right now. And the fact that there's a home under 500,000 is amazing. And this is just one of those things that is, um, you know, it doesn't come up often, but it does come up. And it's a great idea if you're looking for a home under $500,000 in one of the best and most coveted areas here in Henderson, Inspirata. This house was built in 2018, so it's very new. It's 495,000, it's 16, 155 square feet, three bed, three bath, and it comes in at just under 300 a square foot. And as you can tell, I mean, it's a nice home and a nice neighborhood, and we'll take a drive around the neighborhood here in a second, but it's a, just a really nice location. It's very close to schools. One of the big things about Inspirata is it was built as a walking neighborhood. So there's a lot of parks right over on the next street is Via Forenzi. And along that park, there's probably five or six different parks along uh, about a mile or so of that uh, 
street and you have baseball fields, soccer fields, tennis courts, basketball courts, just a great recreation, just a great little home that you can get for under 500,000 or so. It's one that we'll take a look at um, and we'll go take a look at the neighborhood so you can see what the neighborhood is about and then we'll go from there. All right, let's get in the car. Okay, so we're gonna come up to our second house here. Now this house is in the Anthem Hills area of Henderson. And this is very close to Inspirata. In fact, they share a street, it's less than maybe a half mile away from Inspirata. So it abuts the Inspirata where we just came from. And this was one of also the newer developments here in the Henderson area. Now the home that we're coming up to was actually built in 2009. And it uh, is offered at 520,000. It's three bed, two bath, 1,672 square feet. Comes out to about $311 a square foot. Now, one of the great things about this neighborhood and this house is it is literally right across from a park. I don't know if you can see that. And it's right next to Wallen Elementary. Now, if you have elementary school kids, Wallen is one of the most fantastic places to go here uh, on great schools. It has a fantastic rating here in the Clark County School District. But this house is fantastic little house, great place to come and bring your family or yourself or whoever you've got with you and make a, a nice home. This is a very quiet neighborhood. There's not a lot that goes on here because there is nothing but housing in these areas up here. So you don't get a lot of through traffic. If you're looking for more subdued and quiet, this type of neighborhood is fantastic up here. You have lots of parks. You have the school. In fact, you'll see right across from the home, you have this really nice little uh, green park here. So there is lots of greenery in every development here in, in the newer area of Henderson. Because as you can tell, we have a lot of desert landscaping. So we set forth a lot of areas for the community that are green and grassy and all of the things that you would think of. So every community has their own set of parks, has their own set of little green areas like this. And it's just one of the reasons why these master planned communities and Anthem Hills is part of a master planned area. You provide all the community amenities that uh, you would need in a community to make it uh, just a great area to go to. But let me stop talking and keep rambling and we'll jump in the car. We'll take a look around. I'll drive you by Wallen Elementary. I'll drive you by the park and we'll take a look and see what's around here. All right, here we go. Okay, we are at our next house here in the Henderson area for around $500,000. Now this house is in what we call the mid Henderson area. And this was uh, built up from around the nineties up until about 2010 or so. So this is the middle Henderson area, fantastic properties. And a lot of these properties, you actually get a little bit 
bigger lot sizes than you do in the newer Henderson area. So that's one of the big trade-offs. This home that we're going to was built in 1994. It's offered at 495,000. It's a three bed, three bath, and it's 2,059 square feet. Comes out to about $240 a square foot. But you are very close to all kinds of stuff that Henderson has to offer. So this is really the Green Valley area of Middle Henderson. And this is one of the t homes that's available. And this is pretty typical of this type of construction around here. You'll find a lot of these homes and they are great values in comparison to what you can get in some of the areas because you are close to Green Valley Ranch, the district, the new dollar loan center arena, which is where our minor league hockey team, the Silver Knights play. And so you are very close to all of that right here. There's also just a lot of typical commerce and restaurants and all of the stuff that Green Valley and Henderson has to offer. You are super close to all that, but it is a fantastic home. And like I said, all of these houses, very nice. You'll see we still have grass. That's one of the ways that you can tell we were built in the 1990s area. Houses, there, in fact, even across the street, there's a couple of houses with grass, but just a really nice home in a really nice area. Fantastic. We'll take a drive around. You'll see how nice this neighborhood is and that you get a big house. You get, uh, you know, for about $500,000, just a, a nice area to come and move. But let's go take a jump in the car and we'll go take a drive around and we'll see what this area is like. Okay, so we're at our final house, about $500,000 here in Henderson. Now we're still back in the mid Henderson area, which is in, in the Green Valley area of Henderson. So again, this is an area that was developed from the early 90s up through about 2010. The houses have a little bit bigger lot size, but uh, they are a little bit older. This home in particular that we're going to was built in 1991. It's offered for $540 thousand dollars it's 2141 square foot four bed three bath comes out to about 252 dollars a square foot and what you'll find you know it's a very nice home in a great neighborhood again green valley when it was built was the bee's knees to live in. And you'll find that these homes are still great homes with great value. And they're just, they were built fairly well. Um, you'll find a lot of them have been updated and there's been updates in all of them, a lot of them. And it's just a nice place to live. There's a lot here still in that $500,000 range, which would make a great home for you and whoever you're bringing here, your family, your whoever you're moving here with. It's a great area to live in. So that's all we got for today. We'll take a drive around the neighborhood. But uh, after that, if I don't see you in the neighborhood, I'll see you on the next video. Thanks. Thanks.